Man's best friend is now an insect's worst enemy. University of Florida entomologists say a strong sniffer is a valuable tool, and these dogs are trained to use theirs to find one of the most destructive insects in the country, the termite. What he's doing right now is he's trying to pinpoint the area where the strongest scent is. Jose Perriero is a professional dog trainer. He's been working with the University of Florida to refine the dog's termite sniffing techniques and get some scientific data about their abilities. He sells his dogs to pest control operators for use in their business. The advantage of that is that the pest control company can treat that area early on and, and, and actually in a preventative manner and, and actually avoid large costs to the homeowner and to the companies themselves as far as insurance uh, costs and, and repair costs. University of Florida researchers with the Institute of Food and Agricultural Sciences, or IFAS, study the termite dogs to find out if they can do the job and how well. Well, dogs can be used to, the, to find people uh, that are buried in avalanches, if they can be used to find drugs, if they can be used to find explosives, if they can uh, be used for a variety of, of things, why not train them to detect termites? Amazingly, UF studies revealed that properly trained canines are at least 96 percent accurate. They are able to find any species of termite, Dead termites, old damage, or other insects do not distract them, and this Beagle Brigade detects only live activity. In cases where we've taken both dogs and human inspectors out to the same house, dogs will find many more places that termites are infesting than the human inspector will. University of Florida researchers say a little puppy power will revolutionize the pest control industry and save homeowners some big bucks by stopping the termites in their tracks. And even after an area is treated with pesticide, the dogs have a job to do. The, the pest control operator can use the dog at that time to check and see if their treatment was effective because the dog won't tell them that the termite damaged wood that they knew was there. These nosy canines don't seem to mind being the first line of defense against an army of termites. They're rewarded with food, and UF researchers say they could be trained for another line of work in the future. And there's a possibility that these dogs could be used to find um, other insects, uh, invasive species of insects like your red imported fire ant. The University of Florida has lent scientific credibility to this growing field. As a business owner and as someone who's marketing these dogs, it's crucial not just to be able to say to you, hey, my dogs are 98% accurate, but to be able to say, this dog is 98% accurate and the documentation is at the University of Florida and these are the people that you can contact. Of course, not all breeds are cut out for termite detecting. All of the studies done at the University of Florida involved beagles. But as more and more dogs hit the pest control scene, we'll soon find that termites are the ones barking up the wrong tree.